everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are touring a magnificent home. This is on the palm, renovated and constructed by BCI. This property is listed with Freya Wealth exclusively. If you guys have any inquiries about the property, their details will be right here. The specs of the property will be right here. And for now guys, let's begin this tour. of this magnificent home. Now, if you turn around, you look at this gorgeous onyx facade, and then you've got the white contrasting with the blue, with the way that they've actually chosen the glass. Now, over here on my left, they've actually added one of my favorite things, which is a water feature outside the home. I mean, the pebbles, the detailing, at night, it really does come alive. You've got an olive tree right there on my left as well. Now, there is a car garage right there, which is a two-car garage with a gorgeous cantilever on the top. And then you've got the light traveling through. They've picked the nice onyx color, which contrasts really, really well with the house and the design. And you guys are going to see that inside. It's a very, very spacious garage. As you can see, we've been blessed with some beautiful cars here in Dubai today. And it looks amazing with this home. Now, through the garage, you can actually walk into the home and it goes all the way to the staffing quarters which I'm going to show you guys later. Let's go check inside the house. So we are in the entranceway of this home. Now, this is actually an extended entranceway. When they did the build of this home, they decided that they didn't want to have a small hallway when you enter this space, so they extended it outside. And for me, this is rather spacious. You've got the bright flooring before you enter. You've got storage here, so you can actually put your shoes here while you're getting ready you can sit down here and enjoy that beautiful water feature and olive tree outside. Now, you've got a washroom here and then you've got that gorgeous dark tone spotlight fixtures on top, which is just gorgeous. And over here, you've got a guest bedroom. So I'm going to show you guys that later. Now, this is a lift leading you upstairs and to the rooftop, which is very rare to get in garden homes here on the palm. They extended it and they did such a great job. So when you enter this space, you're going to notice the hexagon detailing on the floor. They've got that nice polished flooring, the contrast between the black and the white that we saw outside, they brought it inside as well. Here we have the onyx stairs with the LED lighting underneath, which I absolutely love. This house comes alive during the nighttime. Now, this is one of my favorite things is that this is a rotunda style home on the palm, which is extremely hard to renovate to this standard. So what they actually did is they extended this roof and took away the roof and added a new roof. Hence why this has got one of the most beautiful, beautiful chandeliers coming down. And you've got that gorgeous ceiling height, which is extremely rare to get in a house like this. Now, the way that they've actually implemented this hexagon detailing and the way that they've added the beautiful frames on each entrance of each door, which is one of a kind, I absolutely love it. You've got the living room here, you've got the kitchen in front of me, and right here you have the staffing quarters with the chef's kitchen on that side as well. We're walking into the kitchen area, you've got natural light seeping in, and you've got the Gaganau kitchen appliances. You've got the wine cooler here, which is Gaganau as well. You've got that gorgeous wood finishing, sink here, gorgeous backsplash, which is the same backsplash as material as you have on the island loads of cabinet space and the chef's kitchen on that side as well. You've got this gorgeous, gorgeous Gaganau induction cooker and I absolutely love this feature right there. Contemporary Italian light fixtures on the top. Natural light once again seeping in while you're cooking on this island. I absolutely love a good island and a nice kitchen with the most beautiful view right here. So you've got this gorgeous Catalan Italian table 
that you've got in this beautiful space. You've got the light seeping in. You've got that gorgeous infinity pool. While you're having dinner here with your friends and your family, you will have the sunset. This home has a sunset view. You guys should see what it looks like during golden hour. It is just insane. Got a nice cabinet space here. Art installation on the top with the spotlight fixture surrounding it. Chandelier above the table. Now in front of me, you've got one of the most brightest living room areas because you've got the floor to ceiling windows. So much natural light seeping in. I've not quite seen a garden home designed like this purely because I've not seen so much natural light. I was sat here the other day and I was hypnotized by the beauty of this home and the birds going by and the palm trees blowing in the wind. You've got a gorgeous sofa here with the suede finishing, tables in the center, the way the light actually reflects on it, it is just gorgeous. And then you've got this gorgeous book matched backsplash behind the TV, which is just amazing, and the cabinet underneath as well. Now these are sliding glass doors leading you to the pool area and the garden area, which I'm gonna take you guys to later, but let's just appreciate how beautiful this space is. I mean, you guys tell me, would you rather have a view of a skyline of that beautiful water outside? I know exactly what I would have sitting here underneath the chandelier, light seeping in, sunset time with a drink in my hand. What is not to love? Now let's go check up upstairs. So we're gonna go check out the bedrooms upstairs and we're gonna check out the rooftop, which is just amazing because you have the view of both of the Atlantises. So I'm gonna meet you guys back upstairs. lift you're greeted with the same flooring that you saw downstairs you've got that gorgeous bright finishing with the onyx lining before you enter this bedroom you've got the wooden flooring wardrobe space right there and you've got textured walls on each side which you guys are going to see throughout this home the textured wall i absolutely love it loads of storage space on my right and in front of me you've got the balcony access right next to the bed in the center this is just Gorgeous. I mean, look at the LED lighting behind the headboard, which is suede. And then you've got that nice metal finishing on each side. Light floating on each side as well. All the furniture is mixed and matched and custom made for this house. You've got some Minoti furniture in this bedroom as well. And then you've got the wooden cladding ribbed behind the TV and natural light seeping in. And you can actually see the top of Dubai Marina while you're sat in this room, which sparkles during the night time. They actually made two master bedrooms in this house because they wanted to accentuate the space in each of the rooms because mostly garden homes are relatively quite small, but this one is very, very large. The ensuite bathroom has the contrast of dark and light, which I absolutely love. You've got the double vanity with that glossy finish, mirror in the center, gorgeous freestanding tub, lights above it, spotlight fixtures all around, and you've got that recessed wall in the shower as well and you've got the water closet on that side. I think this is just a gorgeous finishing. It really marries well together. Now we're gonna leave this room and we're gonna go check out the bedroom on the right side. So this bedroom here on the right isn't a master bedroom, but it's a relatively good size. Before we go into this bedroom here, I wanna talk about these gorgeous pillars that accentuate this space. And you've got that chandelier floating all the way down the way they actually moves the way the light travels from upstairs down that chandelier it is just one of a kind this home has to be i know i keep saying this each time i do a tour but i really really love this space and i'm going to check out the bedroom here so before you actually enter this room you've got that gorgeous wooden flooring you've got that beautiful bed in the center two floating lights on each side Italian as well. You guys are going to see a mix of Italian furniture in this home, which is just gorgeous. Rib paneling behind the bed with that suede headboard, which is just chef's kiss. And then you've got the spotlight in front of the art, which is just gorgeous because it really brings out the painting and the art pieces. TV in the center. Behind this, you've got the wardrobe space and then you've got the ensuite bathroom. 
The textured walls are on each side as well, which really contrasts well with this wooden panelling. You've got a nice makeup area, spotlights above, wardrobe space on each side, and then you've got that contrast of the lighter tone and the darker tone on the floor, traveling all the way up. Got that recessed wall above the water closet, walk-in shower and the recessed wall on each side as well. Vanity in the center and spotlight fixtures all the way around. We're gonna leave this space and I'm gonna take you guys to a master bedroom that has the most relaxing, beautiful view that you guys are gonna see. Let's go check that out. So we are back in the center that separates the rooms and we are gonna go into one of the most magnificent master bedrooms. The fact that you can see the water from all different angles and it's just to die for. The sun set in that room is just amazing. Let's go check it out. This room has been designed extremely well because you've got natural light seeping in, got a gorgeous dressing table with the mirror reflecting the waves. Now this seating area is extremely strategic because they've put this gorgeous floor to ceiling glass window and you've got the view of the waves when you are sat down here. I mean, what is not to love? Floating light, you've got that gorgeous onyx porcelain behind the TV, the ribbed panels on each side, cabinet space underneath. Now on front of me, you've got the gorgeous bed with the suede headboard and the rib cladding on each side as well. And you've got the floating light. This bed looks extremely enticing, especially with the light seeping in. You've got balcony access on this side as well. And you've got the view of the pool and that gorgeous, gorgeous water. So when you enter the balcony, you've got that gorgeous Persian Gulf looking at you with the sun literally setting as we speak. This balcony area is on the other bedrooms as well. And then you've got the view of the infinity pool and the water features downstairs with the sunken seating area, which I'm gonna show you guys later. We're gonna go check out the walk-in wardrobe and the most beautiful ensuite bathroom that you guys are gonna see. And all the bedrooms here have ensuite bathrooms as well, which is just amazing. We're in the walk-in wardrobe and you've got these gorgeous wardrobes with the LED lighting inside. And then you've got a German safe which is just extremely rare to find here in Dubai. These safes are extremely expensive. If you look here, you've got the watches that you can put in that will swivel. And over here, if you open this, you've got more storage for your watches and the suede finishing and the detail and that soft close that we absolutely love here on this channel. This is extremely hard to break into, so I wouldn't even bother trying. So going into the ensuite bathroom, You've got that gorgeous gray flooring. This ensuite bathroom has lighter tones before you enter. You've got a seating area before you go into the walk-in shower, but the water closet and the light above the freestanding tub, recessed wall with the LED lighting inside, which is gonna look amazing at night. Imagine yourself having a relaxing bath. It is just gonna be gorgeous. Two double vanities, lights on each side, and then you've got that gorgeous light cream finishing with that gloss over the top as well. Now we are gonna leave the ensuite bathroom and I'm gonna take you guys to the roof terrace, which is extremely rare, like I mentioned to you guys, to find in a garden home here on the palm. And it's just got one of the most amazing jacuzzis overlooking that beautiful water I keep talking about. So we are in the roof terrace, guys. And as you guys can see, there's so much space and natural light seeping in. They created this little space for people that want to party. This is a party home. You've got the own roof terrace with the little mini kitchen. You've got the Siemens appliances, induction cooker, loads of cabinet space, and you've got that rib panel as well. Spotlight fixtures all the way around. And then on the other side, you've got the rib paneling with the LED light as well. Now we're gonna go into the jacuzzi area. It's extremely enticing to get in on a hot summer's day. This is just gorgeous. You've got the beautiful view of the Royal Atlantis, Atlantis, the water, the sun seeping in. This is a perfect party home. Now, this isn't the end of this roof area because there is a terrace downstairs for you to sit here with your friends, enjoying this space. And no one inside the house would know. They've designed it in that way as well. They've even got a washroom on this side and you've got this gorgeous space with the glass panels. So it doesn't actually take away the view. It doesn't take away the sunset. You are gonna be sat here enjoying one of the best sunsets that Dubai can offer. I mean, what is not to love? I was been here for like three days now and this home 
really does have a special place in my heart. Maybe because of all the natural light, maybe because I can see the sea from every angle in this home near enough and I'm extremely grateful. So we are gonna go check out downstairs where the guest bedroom is and we're gonna go check out the pool area. See you guys there. back on the ground floor now we spoke about this space before and I said I was going to show you guys later this is the guest bedroom you walk in you've got that wooden flooring that we saw upstairs it's near enough the same sort of style but this has got that beautiful picture window and you've got that water feature that you can see outside LED lights behind the mirror rib panels on each side and the floating Italian lights same lights that we saw in the kitchen over the island You've got the ensuite bathroom, you've got that darker tone and the lighter tone as well. Recessed wall above the water closet and LED lights behind the mirror as well. So we're going to go outside and this actually connects to the garden area. Now before we go outside, you've got that art installation which is just one of a kind. So this art installation has been placed strategically and you're going to see this area has been made for a party. You've got this piece here, you've got lights on each side so at night you can really see this piece and the lines. It just looks gorgeous. This is a washroom. So if you are entertaining your friends and your family and you don't want them to go inside the house, they can just use this washroom. This is a perfect place for partying. You've got that gorgeous table here underneath this pergola with the light just trickling in. And then we are witnessing one of the most beautiful sunsets I have seen in Dubai for a very long time. Now, this is a very cool feature. Imagine you're here with your friends you've got a party going on, you will literally have a TV come all the way up. You guys can watch a game and you guys can listen to the music and enjoy this space. This is extremely cool. Let me know what you guys think about this. I think it's extremely rare to find this. And they actually ship this TV all the way from Australia because there's a specific type of TV that you need for when it's outdoor so it doesn't overheat. There's actually a fan, an AC behind it to cool down the TV, which is extremely cool. Now over here, you've got this sunken seating area. So you've got a fireplace here in the center, which is made out of travertine. And you can really just see how beautiful it is during the nighttime, which I'm gonna show you guys. You've got the view of the Atlantis. This is extremely cool. You've got this glass panel here. So if you are swimming, you can actually see, which is one of my favorite things. You've got LED lighting underneath the stairs as well. Now, when you go up, You've got this gorgeous pool and it's got a lot of water features, which I'm not going to put on now because you won't be able to hear me. But you've got Rolls Royce starlights in this pool as well. You can kind of see them, but during the night, it looks amazing. These beautiful sun lounges in the water. So if you are looking at the view, enjoying this space, this is the best seat in my opinion. And then you've got the showers there as well. So essentially this home is for entertaining. It's a great party home. You've got the view of the Royal Atlantis as well while you're sat here. I mean, what is not to love? The mosaic tiles in the pool, the beautiful, beautiful breeze when you're sat here. You've got the sunset right in front of you. The best seats in the house. I have thoroughly enjoyed showing you guys this home. I cannot wait to hear what you guys think. Now, if you like this video, make sure you check out this video right here. Speak soon.